I'm pretty good, you? What's new? I kind of met someone new. She's really, really nice. Her name is Shimoda. Anyway, you're gonna meet her soon, real soon. So we'll talk later. All right, see you. Hey everyone, and here she is. This is the bag that I've been waiting for for like months. I initially bought this bag, this is the Shimoda bag. I bought it on their Kickstarter. And I've been waiting for months to get it and finally it arrived this week. So I thought, what better way to kind of do a video about it, talk about the things that I like about it. Obviously there's some things that are wrong with it, but I really, I can't find them yet. And I'm just gonna go through some of the features that I like. But the first thing I like about it is the fact that I can actually attach two tripods to this bag. I can probably attach more than two, but I, there's no reason to carry three tripods or more. So I actually attach them on the sides here and it's really, really nice to have that feature. And these straps work really, really well and they secure the tripod really, really well. Second feature that I like is the fact that inside it fits all my gear. I have a medium core ICU and a small core ICU and that actually fits everything. And in case you're wondering too, I actually sold my Phantom 4 Pro to replace it with a much smaller drone. It made sense too, and that actually arrived this week too, and I've only used it today. And that drone is the Mavic Air, and it fits perfectly in this bag too. So everything I need in terms of my photo camera, my video camera, my extra lenses and my filters, and the drone fits in this bag. And it leaves room for other stuff as well, to put more stuff such as you can actually attach a tent to these straps at the bottom here. You can actually at put a sleeping bag in this front bag. You have this compartment on top that you can actually put clothing, you can put whatever you need and it's separate from the ICU core at the bottom. So you have a top compartment for miscellaneous stuff that you need to carry and a bottom compartment for photo gear. And also what I like is I like the way it opens from the back to access your stuff. It opens from side to side, you know, so it's really, really nice to have that feature. Uh, what I also like about this is the fact that I can put a hydration pack on the front and it has its own route to kind of go out the back. And that allows me to pretty much have my water with me all the time. I never used to have a place to carry my water bottle and I wanted my hands free, so I never really brought any water with me. And now this seems like this bag, they thought of everything for photographers. I also like this top compartment here where I can actually store things like my leaf filter, my first aid kit, a rain cover, anything I can sink off, it goes right here on the top that I need quick access to. Also all the extra batteries I have, the charger, everything, I keep it in this medium clear bag where I can see it has a window on each side, you can actually see what's inside and it's neatly organized in two sections so it's quite nice to have, you know. Also what I like about this bag is the straps, they're really really comfortable and you have a place to put your phone, you have a place to put some snacks, you have a place to put some trash if you have any. And it seems like they thought up everything you might need and they thought of it well. So it's really, really comfortable. And these straps as well, you can adjust them to different sizes. You have X large, large, medium and small. And that's kind of perfect for different kind of people. And I find it, it fits me perfectly and it's really, really comfortable, especially going on hikes. I found it to be super comfortable, much more comfortable than my other bag. I really do like the material that they use for this bag. It just seems like it repels all the water, snow, whatever. Now I really haven't put it to the test yet with all kind of elements, but so far I'm happy with the results. If you guys are considering buying this bag and if you have any questions about something, I probably missed a couple of things. Do let me know in the comments and I'll be happy to answer them. Maybe you want to buy it and you want to know a bit more about it. I'm happy to, to do that. All right, let's continue on the hike. Well, obviously I'm not gonna leave here without actually taking a photo. 
and I think this is a perfect opportunity to do a Chris Sale style selfie with my new bag. So I'm gonna do that right now. Well, now that that's done and out of the way, I kind of wanted to share something a little bit personal with you. I mean, ever since I was a young kid, I've always had a lot of imagination growing up, and I knew that I'm gonna be doing something creative in my life. It wasn't photography at the time, but once I discovered it, this was my, I felt like this was my calling. And once I started making videos, it was also my creative outlet. I do enjoy making these videos very, very much and taking pictures equally i mean i have to i want to do this every week so it'd be very much appreciated if you guys just subscribe to my channel and leave me a comment any of the two i'm really really happy so this is it for this week and i hope you guys enjoyed this video and until next time